Namaste, I am Krishna Yatanya Mandela, your EV Pro. Today we have two made in India electric cycles with us. These are completely designed and developed in India. If you look at this electric cycle, seems like you, you might feel like this has been an imported electric cycle. But the truth is this is completely made in India. Actually from Indian, they have developed this electric cycle, a company called Astra. So Astra means a kind of weapon. A against the pollution, this is the solution electric cycle. So this is the rifle T9 model most for the city ride commuting and this is a carrier this is for mostly for the business purpose if you look at the targeted audience for these electric cycles mostly for students and for college going students this is for the perfect kind of electric cycle and if you look at the carrier electric cycle mostly for business purposes and the main USP is what I like about this electric cycle they are offering three years of warranty on the battery pack and one year of warranty on the charger and no company is offering charger warranty but this company is offering warranty on the charger as well and the targeted audience for the rifle electric cycle is the software employees as well now coming to the usp of this electric cycle this is the company is offering three years of warranty on the battery pack and the charger no company is offering three years of warranty on the charger but astra electric cycles are offering warranty on the charger so now let's have a complete review on both these electric cycle let us talk about the rifle t9 model definitely one of the kind of a rifle kind of look Nobody will think that it is made in India, but the fact is it is actually made in India, designed and developed. The company have developed this electric cycle for three years. Especially for the Indian road condition, they have developed this electric cycle. So the wheel size of this electric cycle is 26 inch and the width is 3 inches. Especially you will get the good looking fat, fat tires here for better grip on the road conditions. And you will also get a mud guard along with this electric cycle and a light at the for the night time visibility and the rear side also will get the same kind of size 26 inches uh, tube tires and if you look at the power train they are using a BLDC hub motor offers a power of 250 watt but the good part about this electric scooter they have improved the torque especially for load conditions if, if, if you are going on an up incline it shouldn't reduce any kind of power that kind of way they have in, improved the torque for this motor and the top speed of this electric cycle is up to 25 km per hour now the unique feature what i like about this electric cycle they're not only offering a front telescopic suspension but also a monoshock suspension at the rear side let me show you the suspension feel you can see right it, it's more feel like an electric bike instead of an electric cycle that kind of a comfort you can get in this uh, rifle electric cycle and this electric cycle having an adjustable seat option just you need to open this and just you can adjust the seat based on your uh, hiding comfort then you need to lock it so you will get a quick release for it so easy to adjust the seat and based on your hiding adjust comfort now one more unique point for this electric cycle is the detachable battery pack Usually most of the electric cycles comes with a fixed battery pack but Astra comes with an in-frame battery pack. It, it, if you look at this, there is no battery pack but there is a battery pack existed. Let me show you. This is a battery pack. You just need to anti-clockwise, you need to press the key and you need to remove this wire. So this is a removable battery pack you will get with uh, the rifle electric cycle. It is actually 13 age battery pack and uh, 36 volt so combined with you it will offer you up to 70 kilometers of range in the pedal assist mode with throttle mode you will get up to 50 kilometers of range and to charge this electric cycle it will take around three hours of charging time for 80 percentage for complete 100 percent charge it will take around four hours of time so again you need to keep the battery pack back to the original position just you need to put it back and that's it the battery pack gets locked 
This is a kind of unique feature offering with Astra Electric Cycle. And protection wise, this battery pack comes with IP65 protection and also one more protection, it comes with metal casing. And these are the switches. This is the light switch and this is the pedal assist switch. 3, 2, 1 and this is the horn. And this is the LCD display we will get with this electric cycle. You can see the voltage of the battery pack and the battery percentage indication and the trip meter and the odometer reading as well. Once you start riding this electric cycle, even you can see the speedometer as well. Now we have one more special electric cycle, the carrier. And the, what I especially like about this electric cycle, it can bear a load of capacity of up to 140 kgs. So this mostly useful for cargo purpose, not just for a single utility purpose, you can use it for multi-utility purpose. Now coming to this weight of this electric cycle, just 24 kgs, you, you, you can even lift this electric cycle, that electric cycle weight is 20 kgs of weight. And the carrier electric cycle, the tire size is 26 inch, but the width of this tire is 2.4 inch. And coming to this uh, braking system, it comes with front end disc braking system, also telescopic suspension at the front side. And it comes along with the mudguard and also the same kind of a lighting which was offered in the rifle model. And the rear side, you get the powertrain of 250 watt BLDC hub motor. Again, same kind of innovation they have used. They have increased the high torque motor. So they have increased the torque for this motor. Usually, even if you keep load of up to 140 kgs of weight, even if you're going on a uphill inclined also you don't find any kind of pickup drops that is one more innovation they have put up in the astra carry electric cycle and this top speed of this electric cycle also 25 km per hour and coming to the seating adjustment they are offering a quick release as well so you can easily adjust the seat according to the rider comfort so depend depends on the rider comfort you can just adjust the seat even the seat also they, there are three saddles are available this is a Long seat adjustment is available, it, even there is a thin seat availability is also there. It's, it's all depends on the rider comfort. According to the rider, they can choose the what kind of seat they need. Then you can to press this kind of uh, once again, then, th then the seat will be adjusted automatically. Now coming to the rear side, you will ca get a carrier. This is an inbuilt carrier along with this electric cycle. But if you want, if you want an additional option, like you need to carrier kind of luggage purpose point of view then you have additional extension so it is a kind of utility point of view it can be manageable according to the loads not just the carrier any kind of luggage carrying purpose they can adjust to that they can they can add additional frames also depends on the rider comfort at the front portion of view also the, you can keep a carrier also for for loading loading point of view now coming to the innovation carry electric cycle also comes with a removable battery pack let me show you how to remove this battery pack. So just to anti-clockwise, then you can remove the battery pack. From here, you need to remove the battery pack. So once you remove the battery pack, you can see the weight of the battery pack is up to 6.5 kgs of weight. And the battery package is 21 age. So on a full charge, you will get a range of up to 100 kilometers of range in the pedal assist mode. On th complete throttle, you will get a range of up to 80 to 85 kilometers. For complete charging, it will take around 4 to 4.5 hours of charging time whereas 3 hours of time for 80 percent of charging again if you want to keep the battery pack into the original position just you need to keep the battery pack just you need to pull the key to the clockwise direction then the automatically the battery pack gets locked now coming to the switches similar kind of switches what they have offered in the rifle model similar kind of switches can be expected in the model of uh, carry electric cycle as well same design especially in kind of switches and also the LCD display also offering the same kind of display. So let's go for a test ride on rifle teen and electric cycle and check the performance of it. So this is actually complete off-road electric cycle mostly for your city commuting. So for students or for college going people or even for a software engineer kind of work you going for that definitely you can go for a check, test ride on this electric cycle. Let me start with the suspension feel because the USP of this electric cycle lies in the suspension. So usually in India, you don't find any kind of a dual suspension electric cycle. For the first time, I'm seeing this uh, rifle T9 to have a dual suspension, front telescopic suspension and the rear monoshik mono suspension. So you can see the action of it. So especially if you like to go for complete uh, throttle mode instead of this uh, pedal assist mode, then you will de definitely like this electric cycle. The reason is, most of the time if you are doing pedal assist you can uh, you can just escape from the irregular roads but if you are going on a, with a dual spring suspension you can even enjoy this electric cycle with the seat also and let me talk with this uh, comfort feel level of the seat it basically depends on the seat uh, you have preferred 
uh, this seat is uh, suitable for me in the same way depends on the reader uh, depends on the rider seat you can go with the seat definitely you can enjoy that so moreover i i am just giving the, i am just riding this electric cycle mostly for this uh, throttle mode not on the pedal assist mode so if you go, if you are trying to go with the pedal assist mode then you can you can observe the difference of the seat seat comfort so let me let me do the pedaling so actually the charging is almost like 50 percentage so that is the reason it is taking somewhat time for the pedal assist mode now i am going on the uh, incline road so this is how the performance uh, it will add additional additional energy for, for your legs especially the pedal assist mode the battery power will give you when you are offering that uh, additional additional power from your legs then the battery will do this uh, support also so the pedal assist mode especially you need to go in the third third mode for this uh, inclined roads but usually if it is a slope road normal down slope then you can go with the pedal assist one or two so mostly in the pedal assist one you don't find much difference now i'm shifted to pedal assist one so not much any action you can have observed with the pedal assist mode one so now i'm shifted to pedal assist mode two so pedal assist mode to somewhat you, you can observe the power from the battery pack and the more power you will get in the pedal assist mode 3 only so this is a mode 3 obviously instant power you will get from the battery pack it, it can be released automatically and now coming the bra braking actually it's been uh, as it is under this uh, test ride vehicle it's not been completely upgraded braking so the rear braking is action fine so moreover you give the pedal and also you need to throttle both the times so that you, you can enjoy the feel of uh, throttle uh, rifle teen and electric cycle and the adjustable adjustable things are the seat but if you, if you are going in the right different but if you are riding this electric cycle in the, in the different slope conditions you can slightly observe the battery percentage deviation so initially even if it is fully charged also slowly if you are consuming the battery pack then you can observe that in the lcd display so that is one more good indication most of the electric cycles uh, don't provide accurate reading but this electric cycle is offering that kind of uh, reading as well and also the trip meter also showing that how many kilometers you have traveled so for both the rifle tnn is uh, both for exercise purpose and also for uh, fun riding also you have to you have to ride this uh, tnn electric cycle the truly the rifle electric cycle feels like a bullet in the electric cycle segment just wow i just completed this uh, rifle tnn electric cycle uh, overall ride feeling so here is my verdict on this electric cycle the first thing what i really like about this electric cycle is the dual suspension usually electric cycle offer only the front sus telescopic suspension but this electric cycle comes with a mono shock suspension at the rear side that will more gives like a kind of dancing kind of feel you can enjoy this electric cycle not only with throttling but also kind of a comfort you will get and the second thing more comfortable ride experience especially the fat tires offering one of the best grip on the different kind of irregular road conditions and the next thing what i really like about this uh, lcd display of Offering. most of the electric cycle just offering a basic uh, battery percent indicator but it will offer you the voltage odometer and also the speed also so these are the major attractions and the rear side point of view you can see the disc braking action also spot on disc braking action so these are the positive elements of this uh, rifle tin and electric cycle close like a bullet now coming to the pricing of this electric cycle actual price of this electric cycle is close to 45000 rupees but there is a uh, limited period offer for this electric cycle where you can get this electric cycle for just 40000 rupees and the company is also offering 3 years of warranty on the battery pack and the charger and same credit card not just credit card zero mm option you, even if you have a debit card also you can purchase this electric cycle on zero mm option that is what one of the unique kind of feature offering from this uh, astra electric cycles overall this electric cycle is most suitable for audience like uh, school children college going college going and also for software employees who want to save money on their daily commutes so finally we need to support startups like astra because they are having a patent on their design i i am very sure that you you will never seen an electric cycle especially with this unique kind of design most of this conventional electric cycles you, you will get bored of but if you see this t9 uh, rifle look design definitely it will feel like a rifle so that kind of innovation they have kept on this electric cycle if you ride this electric cycle you will definitely feel that what's the difference between another electric cycle and this electric cycle so this is the carry electric cycle from astra so let's go for a test ride and check the performance of it so initially let me go with the pedal assist mode 
So there are three pedal assist levels are there. So the first mode it offers very less power. So you don't you don't consume more power in the first pedal assist mode. So right now I'm going in the pedal assist mode. You can see the action of the electric cycle. Now I'm shifting to the second pedal assist mode. So it is taking some time. So compared to the first mode and second mode, there is a slight difference varies in the pedal assist mode. So it depends on the uh, load you are facing. So it depends on the load you need to use the pedal assist mode. So more or if I go in with the throttle, let me show you the throttle performance. So the top speed is 25 kph because, because we are riding, test riding in, inside the campus. We are not going with much speed, hardly touching up to 15 km per hour top speed. Another aspect about this electric cycle, it's about the suspension field. Now coming to the range point of view, the battery percent indicator shows you 4 bars. So based on that, more precise range can we can observe in this electric cycle. And also the speedometer also visibility is pretty much fine even in the sun road conditions also. And coming to the braking action, let me, let me show you the brake action for you. So smooth braking action comes with this Astra carry electric cycle. And coming to this is the third pedal assist mode. So the, in the third pedal assist mode, you will get more energy for your legs. So the more battery power consumption will happen in the third pedal assist mode, but still you will get more, more, more kind of performance in this uh, third pedal assist mode. And finally, in my experience, this uh, carry electric cycle is best suitable for this uh, cargo purpose. So especially if you are keeping load more than 100 kgs and also additional carrying capacity can be offered from this uh, carry electric cycle. So I, I personally like this kind of Spider-Man kind of feel. So you just give that power automatically that you can feel that from the pedal assist. Overall, I have fi finished the test ride on this uh, carrier electric cycle. Here is my final uh, summary on this electric cycle. First thing which attracts about this electric cycle is the rugged kind of design. Even though it may feel lightweight 24 kgs, but you can carry up to 140 kgs of weight. And the other aspect, it's about the easy controlling. Especially in the pedal assist mode, you just give just normal kind of pedaling also in the and the pedal assist third mode, you, you will get instant spring kind of action. So it will it will give a kind of feel that you need to go you need to go more kind of pedal assist mode only. That kind of a positive feel it will create in the carrier electric cycle. Additional carrier you will get. You can keep more luggage on this electric cycle. And moreover, commercial point of view, this electric cycle offering the best point of value addition. That is one more addition thing. And the seat also more comfortable feel. Usually I have ridden so many electric cycles, but the saddle what they are offering, what you can say the kind of cushion they are offering, it feels more comfortable to me. And also the adjustment of the electric cycle also another plus point. So these are the positive options of carrier electric cycle. Now coming to the pricing of carrier electric cycle, the actual X showroom price is 49,990 rupees, but there is a limited period offer for this electric cycle where you can get it for just 44,444 rupees. And coming to the warranty, three years of warranty on the charger and the battery pack and also one year warranty on the display as well. And also EMI also providing from this electric cycle, not, not on the credit card option, no cost EMI will be provided for the debit card also. If you have a debit card, you will get no cost EMI also available. You, you, kindly you can utilize that kind of option. It, it is first kind of option in, in electric cycle segment. So carrier electric cycle is most suitable for business point of view, B2B customers. If you are planning to buy this electric cycle in bulk order, like 10 to 20 units, the company is offering uh, additional kind of uh, utility purpose, like they will do all the customization requirement, whatever you have, like if you need additional carrier at the rear side also, the company will do. That is what the company is offering for B2B customers. So audience who are interested to buy these electric cycles, you can, you can purchase this electric cycle from their website or through Flipkart or Amazon and we will provide the contact numbers. You can see the contact numbers on the screen. Also, we will provide the contact details in the description below. If you like this video, please like, share and subscribe to EV Bro. Charge the nature, drive the future.